Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I've been shopping again. This will be most of my videos now as we're coming up to Christmas because there's just so much out there. Um, yeah, so I've been shopping. Uh, so Wilkinson's and a Poundland because there wasn't enough to do a video each. Um, Wilkinson's got a really good deal at the moment on toys. Um, yeah, so I would suggest to go to Wilkinson's and have a look at stuff because they've got some really good deals at the moment. But I'll start with the Poundland bag. Cheap size flicks. I don't know what the sin value is on this, but I will check. But this is the cheap size. And I love her chocolate. And we're going to have a hot chocolate station this Christmas. So I thought these would be cute in the little, um, in the little station. Um, yeah. So mini I will check the sin value and put it on the comments below. So these were from all of these, the next ones were from Poundland. So I got these. I got um, low sin treats. I got these pink and white. I think they're two and a half. But again, I'll have to double check because they're lovely. They are lovely and they're so handy to have in the cupboard box to put in the Christmas Eve hamper. There is going to be a video on the Christmas Eve hamper. Um, so these are pound each from uh, Pound Poundland. Pound what? Yeah, Poundland. So one of them's in the Nativity Story and one Santa's Stowaway. Um, up the train of teaching Leah on the Nativity and everything that Christmas represents, not just the whole Santa, which I love. I love the whole elf, I love the whole Santa thing, but I do need to get her back and well, start going through with all this again. But what I loved about these ones, they're pop-up ones. So I thought it was quite cute. Um, the illustrations are lovely, but I like the pop-up effect on them. Leah loves books, she really, really does. So I thought that was a really nice thing to have in the Christmas Eve box. Just to go back to basics with it all, because I think it's really important that she knows this side of Christmas as well, not just the, the presents and the Santa Claus thing. And then the Santa, I did get the Santa Claus one as well, which again is a really nice pop up y book, um, which is really, really cute. But the, it's really a lovely book. So it's a from Poundland as well. So they're going to go on the Christmas Eve hamper. I have a nephew that is obsessed with Octonauts and he just makes me giggle every time I see Octonauts. I just think of what he does with his little hat. Oh, he cracks me up. I got some uh, Maryland treat cookies, they're not mainly for Rob, but again, when we're in having a hot chocolate ham um, station, they'll be in there just to dip in. I got these animal dominoes, which I thought would be quite cute for Leah's stocking. Hold on, they're wooden dominoes, um, which I thought was quite cute for her to play with. She is quite good on her animals and stuff, so some little fairy lights. So I'm going to put along the bed there, just to make it Christmassy. So they are a pair. Treats, chocolatey treats. They're for me. Absolutely love these. Yorkies and some Magic Stars. Some of these could be gifts. I'm not necessarily going to have all these as my treats, or the family's treats, because that the chocolate, there's too much chocolate in the house as it is. But some of them are to add into hampers that I'm going to do for Christmas. Um, so whoever's watching that's having a hamper for me, you know what you're having. But you don't know who's having what. Or you don't know who's having a hamper, so you won't know. This, because a certain somebody loves these. So I bought that. These. I've seen these loads on Instagram at the moment. The Frutella fruit gums. Oh, I've had fruit foams before. I thought the fruit foams were like 8 cents. I don't know how much the fruit f fruit gums are. They're sugar free. Again, I'll have to check the sin value of these. I'm not very prepared. Um, but I got these in Poundland. In these coffees they have there, the Irish cream ones. A six for a pound. So it's not the best value for money. Six for a pound. But I was desperate for coffee. So I got them. So that's everything from Poundland. Obviously everything was a pound. 
Cause as I said, they've got the toy event at the moment, so there is like discounted off toys. Um, so Jake will only be six months old, and honestly, if I give him a box, he'd be quite happy with it, wrapping paper. And he's so in, he's just fascinated with Leah. Anything Leah does, he will just, he just loves her so much. He's so cute to watch. But I got this little train. Um, and then when he moves, all the balls go across, the different colour balls. So I thought that was cute when he's starting to crawl and stuff. It's quite big. Um, they can hold on to it and move along with it. So I got him some of these Reese's uh, favourite collection. I love, I love this. These are possibly my favourite things. But I think, again, this is a gift. So... <clears throat> I'll resist. The thing I picked up was this um, wooden cut and play birthday cake. It's made with wood. Um, we're going to a little girl's birthday tomorrow. Uh, so Saturday, so this will be after Saturday. And I th Leah had one of these for her birthday and she still plays with it now. Um, I know from two years plus, but it can be display only until then until she's old enough but I think it's really, they're really I love wooden toys especially what they can play with and everything and I know her mum loves cake so she can see in this and pretend that she's eating cake um, tissue paper for a pound and it's got a really nice um, Christmas pudding on it and like a really nice red and this is going to like go in my hampers just to fill the bottom up I got myself a 2018 diary week to view which I need next year with going back to work appointments get, oh, the kids are, um, the kids jobs back to school nursery uh, it'll get full and I, I know I've got my phone but I like to see everything when I'm trying to organize stuff in this but these for Leah to go in a stocking because she's really into drawing at the moment um, it's my favourite time with her when we can just sit down and draw because she she's so she loves it. So I got these and I thought they were good because they've got the soft grips on the top. Um, so I got her there. And these were reduced because I think there's a colour missing but washable markers, which is good. But I picked them up because they were on off. Well, they were reduced. Up this. So these blocks from Wilkinson's Lego has lost their pink tint with the Lego. So these Blot Wilco's own brand is can fit into normal Lego and it's n no price at all compared to Lego. Um, I think this was like, it was meant to be £15, I think I paid 10 for it, but it's got all the little figurines in there um, of all different people. So it's got like aliens and a burglar, fireman, policeman. It's got everybody. He hasn't got a woman though. He hasn't got a woman, which I'm quite surprised about. They're all men. Hmm. There's, anyway, there's 50 figurines in there. Should have women in there, but the hey-ho. Oh yeah, there is. There is. Sound corrected, there is a woman. Hmm. Yeah, there is a woman in there. But I thought that was really good value. And yeah, I didn't get this on this chip, but I did get it before. These blocks. Um, and I just said they're compatible with other construction kits, compatible with leading brand. So that's why Lego's lost their patent. So if you've got Lego, and you can build onto it now. I think these were like £2.50. So, yeah. And they've got really good kits there. Really, really good kits. So that will keep them quiet. So that's everything I had from Poundland and Wilkinson's. So again, ticking off the, the Christmas list. Ticking off the um, Christmas Eve hamper. Ticking off hampers for people. Stocking fillers done, so I'm getting on my hot chocolate stand, which I'm in progress of doing. 
So I am quite impressed with what I got for the value of money at Poundland and Wilkinson's. Um, yeah, there is going to be a video on my Christmas Eve hamper. The Elf on the Shelf will be coming out soon, so there'll be videos on that. Um, and there'll be videos on the stocking fillers for the children, because I've got one that's two, and one that's... Well, one, two, and... Two, and one, that'll be six months. So I'll be doing stocking fillers on, on them. Um, yeah, so that's everything I got. Thanks for watching, guys. Do su subscribe. There'll be loads of content coming up soon, um, especially this time of year. I love it. But thank you for watching, guys. Hope to see you again soon. Thanks, bye.